Hello everyone. In this tutorial I'll be showing you three different ways to make your computer run much faster. Now, these three methods delete any files that just take up space in your computer and slow it down. So, to start off, first you want to go to the start menu, then click on run. Now what you want to type in is percent or shift 5 TMP and percent again. Make sure you spell it the right way or it won't work. So then click OK. And a new window should pop up with a bunch of files. What you do here is you just want to highlight all of them like like I'm doing. You just click you just left click and hold until you highlight all of them. Now I can't do it with the files I have on my screen because they're currently in use, but you should be able to um now, there are certain files that you are not allowed to delete, and those are the system files. So you can just ignore those files and proceed on to the other ones that are on the screen. Uh, once you're done with that, you are actually finished with my first way. So you can just exit out. And now, my second way is by going to Start, All Programs, go up to Accessories then system tools and disk cleanup now if you want to use disk cleanup um, more than once or you want to use it often you just right click it and and send to desktop create shortcut um, that's for those of you who want to use it more than once I think it's a really good uh, program it's very useful so anyways um, however you get to it just click on it and you should get this window telling you that it should take a few minutes to complete um, so I'll pause my video and I'll resume it once it finishes loading okay everyone so this cleanup has finished loading uh, so you should have gotten this window what you do from here is you just go to this list and make sure that all of them are checked now to check an item you just want to go to the box to the left of it and click it. So once you're done checking all of them you just want to click OK. Now I won't do it right now because I recently used this cleanup but once you click OK um, you should get a window identical to the one I had before uh, saying that it should take a few minutes um, however the process should take about 20 to 30 minutes so uh, just make sure your computer is free um, you're not downloading anything you're not running any internet pages um, and once it's done it should automatically close itself um, and that will indicate that you are finished with disk cleanup uh, so we'll move on to my third way which is by using another useful program however um, you go to start all programs accessories then you want to go to system tools and underneath disk cleanup is disk defragmenter now you can also create a so shortcut for this uh, program by right clicking going to send to and go click on desktop uh, anyways, when you click on Disk Defragmenter, you should get this window. Now, um, what this is, uh, it should list your hard disk. Um, right now, I have the C drive. That would be my hard disk. Um, and it should tell you the amount of free space you have and the amount of free space you have out of 100. Anyways, what you want to do is you want to go to the bottom of this window and click on defragment. Now, just wait for it uh, to finish analyzing. Um, this should take about a minute or so. Um, and once it's finished analyzing, it should start defragmenting, as you see on my screen. Now, this process should take about two to three hours. So I recommend that you have a lot of time on your hands because this will take a while and you're just going to make it 
even slower if you run a download or you you are you know browsing the internet so I'll pause my video and I'll resume it once it finishes defragmenting alright everybody so this defragmenter has finished defragmenting on my computer so this is what you should get when this defragmenter is done uh, a window should pop up telling you that defragmentation is complete for whatever hard disk you have and it gives you the option of viewing the report or closing it now I'll I'll view the report just for a few seconds just to show you what it does or what it shows you it uh, it pretty much shows you all the information such as um, how much how much um, free space you had before and how much you have after or how much free space has been removed like how much free space has been added actually um, how many files size of the files how many um how much like gigs or how much megabytes ha have you deleted and such so on like that uh, I think that um this is very good just to uh, to compare before and after um, I mean if you want to print it you can click print over here if you want to save you can save it um, so that's just uh, some additional information if you want to know so now you are actually done with this defragmenter and you are done with my third way so this concludes my video I hope this helped you